This video will show you how to use a custom domain name with your website. A custom domain name would be, for example, www.mywebsite.com. You can use any domain name you'd like. First, you'll need to go to a domain name company such as godaddy.com and purchase a domain name. Once you've done that, go and log into your account and from the dashboard, uh, go to either under products or to websites or just click the Your Website button. It'll take you to the same place. Here you'll see a list of websites. Click on the one you want to use a custom domain for. On this page, in the general settings box, you'll see some information regarding your website. First is name. You can type in whatever you'd like here. You're the only one who will see this. No one else will, so it's just for your reference. Here, under website ID, if you contact support, they might ask you for the ID of your website. This is where you find it. Uh, down here, it says type of domain, custom domain, or placeholder. For example, this one is using a placeholder that says site and has a number after it, then .bizsitetoday.com. In this drop-down, there are many different uh, temporary domain placeholder domains you can use. Um, also down here at the bottom says name servers. Before you can use a custom do domain, you need to go purchase one from a company such as GoDaddy.com. Then on GoDaddy's website, you would log in and for that domain name that you've already purchased, set the name servers to what's listed here, these three name servers. Once you've done that, come here to this page, click on Use Custom Domain, type whatever domain you want to use. You don't have to put www, that's optional. But you can put www if you want. It'll work with or without www. Both ways are completely fine. Even if you don't type in www, your website will still work with the www, so don't worry about it. And make sure, of course, like I said, you had to have previously updated your name servers for this to work. Otherwise, your website won't work until you've done that. And once you've entered your domain name, just hit Save. It will give you a message telling you to take it a few minutes to rebuild your website. Don't worry, your data is completely safe in our database. Uh, once that's done, you can use your new website on your new domain. Please contact support if you have any further questions.